it's your girl crystal also known as good girl gone fashion and welcome back to my channel make sure you give this video a thumbs up make sure you are subscribed and make sure you're following me on instagram at good girl gone fashion happy august it is august the first monday and today i have a july favorite I know, I know, I skipped June, but we're gonna ease right on into July. And I'm also going to announce the giveaway at the end of this video. So make sure you stick around. All right, so starting off with my first July favorite. And I know this just came out on July the 29th, but it has been in a constant you hear me a constant rotation over here in this house and in my car and in the workplace that one day i was at work when it came out is none other than who i like to call her miss batty b <laughs> yes beyonce released her renaissance album act one it has been six years. Now I get it that not everyone is a Beyonce fan, but you have to understand her thought process and her craft and the body of work that she just released is mind blowing. The vocals, the transitions, it's almost like you don't know when the song ends, you're already on the next song. I mean, it's just a beautiful piece of work overall. That is definitely a July favorite. I know it's gonna go right into being an August favorite. I leave for vacation in a couple of days and I'm already thinking about the reels, the everything, the listening to the music and the room. I'm just obsessed with it. It's such a good album. Um, if you haven't listened to it, go ahead and check it out. Also, let me know in the comments what y'all are thinking. Are you liking it? Are you not liking it? Let's um, give a little bit of feedback here. I love it. I love Beyonce. And this is not just because I'm a huge Beyonce fan. It's just because how can you not respect this woman? Mind blowing, mind blowing. So yes, that is my first July favorite, even though it's been, what, three days? Yes, oh well. Anywho, moving on to the next July favorite. I had to try this perfume company. It's called Oil Perfumey, Perfumery, sorry. And I tried the scent Love by Killian. Don't be shy. This is so good i eventually want to get the actual um fragrance from um killian and not from this other brand but my girlfriend told me to try this it was 19.99 and y'all she's a missile she is a missile i love putting her on she lasts she will last pretty much all day and as I get whiffs of her throughout the workday, I just find myself like happy, like smiling, like, ooh, like, I see you girl, like, I see you, I smell you, like all the good things. But this is the brand Oil Perfumery. I will link it below. below. And the fragrance I tried out is um, Love by Killian, Don't Be Shy. My coworker also ordered this. She got the extreme version. I really couldn't tell a difference. It is a little bit more potent, but it's practically the same. But yes, y'all, make sure you check it out. I've already used a good amount of it and I'm probably gonna have to get another one before I actually buy the real fragrance from Killian. But yes, make sure you check them out. <laughs> now, next, I have been loving, um, my best friend makes some of the best candles I have ever smelled. He is a black owned business 
and he has a candle called Nude that we all love and adore. Um, excuse how it looks. I've been using it. <laughs> She's been in use, <laughs> but um, she smells so good. If I can get any like notes or fragrances from him, I'll pop them on the picture. The name of his company is K Phillips and Company. I do not think that he has any more of these right now. Hopefully he'll make some more. And if he does, I would definitely let y'all know. But this smells so light and airy. It's not a harsh scent at all. So if you have like a sensitive nose, this will be like perfect for you. So yes, um, this is the nude candle by um, my best friend, um, Cal, um, who has the company K Phillips and Company. And hopefully he will have more of these soon. I have like trying to savor this, but I want to burn her like every single night. So yes, I love her and she's definitely a July favorite. So like I said, if he makes any more, I would definitely let you all know so you can check it out because he has other scents as well. Moving right along. <laughs> I have been obsessed with these H&M flip-flops. <laughs> They are padded, they are thick, they are so freaking comfortable. And yes, they are white. However, I still love them. Um, I ordered these um, a couple of weeks ago and I think they still have a few sizes left. They have white and they have a beige. I ordered my sister the beige. She is obsessed with them. She wears them all the time. Um, her foot is smaller than mine, but um, they're still so cute. Um, I just love how like plush they are. I have had to take a Clorox wipe to these a couple of times. And just a couple of wipes, I feel like I kind of refreshed them because <laughs> they were given... <sighs> they were given like I didn't almost like have a roof over my head. They were They were given a little do you need some help? Like, girl, do you need some help? But I cleaned them on up and they are perfect. I love them. So I will definitely link these below. They are so comfortable. I have been wearing them since I got them nonstop. I'm contemplating on taking them on vacation just because I know I'm going to be walking around a resort and they'll be super comfortable, but am I going to dirty them up? That's the only downside with the white, but they are definitely a favorite of mine. So yes, I will link these below and please check them out. They are super comfortable, super, super comfortable. All right, the next favorite that I have are these glasses that I found in Ross for $9.99. And they're by the brand Steve Madden. I, I, I know I showed y'all in my little haul that I did that day, but just look how clean these glasses look. Look how the aviator style alone is just a classic, a classic. And the fact that they are like muted and they're the same color all the way around the pink lens. I love how you can see my eyes. I'm loving that a lot lately, how you can see like my eyes through the gradient lenses. They are just gorgeous. And for these to be Steve Madden and be at Ross for $9.99, just look at that color. It's such a neutral color. I couldn't pass these up. $9.99, I mean, come on. And like I said, most people are not like really big on Ross or stuff like that. But when you can come across stuff like this, it's like, girl, you're only playing yourself. So I love these, I'm obsessed with them. I will wear these into the ground. 
I actually kind of wish I had a backup pair. Yeah, I'm that girl. But yes, I love those. And my last favorite is, um, I featured her items before on another month of my favorites. Can't remember which month, but it is my Glamaholic mesh bag, y'all. She has been worn non-stop. I love the mesh. It's completely covered in G's. Um, the lady who does these, her name is Mia Ray. She has Glamaholic. Um, it's her brand. And she just makes the cutest, fun pieces that just make you feel so girly. I took this to the beach recently. I travel with her. I take her to work. I mean, I go run my errands with her. I just love it. I love the top handle. And I just, you can use it just for traveling and put your toiletries in it. But I just love it as just a purse. Just as simple as that. I don't know what I'm gonna do come fall and winter. I have my eye on a bag for fall and winter, but I just love her. I just love her. She's just so nice and she fits such a good amount of stuff. So yes, make sure you check out her brand. I have this bag, I have a fanny pack, I have another mesh beach bag, I have another pink travel case, um, I have a card holder. I just really love her stuff and she is just like a bomb. I don't know if I can cuss. <laughs> She's just a bomb girl, bomb woman like, she just personifies boss, period. But yeah, um, that's my last July favorite. And now, as far as the giveaway, what I would like to do is you have to be following me on TikTok. I will get better on posting on TikTok, but you have to be following me on TikTok, Instagram, and you have to be subscribed to my YouTube channel. And what I will do is for my favorites for the months of January through May, I will pick one item from those favorites and create a gift box for you all of items that I personally love and that are my favorites and hopefully you will love them as well. Um, and I will also give you a pair of vintage earrings because y'all already know, I love me some good vintage earrings. So yes, for the giveaway, you have to be following me on TikTok, Instagram, Good Girl Gone Fashion, and you have to be subscribed to my YouTube channel. channel. I will randomly pick a person and I will give them a box of my favorites. One item from January, February, March, April, and May. So you'll have five items plus a pair of vintage earrings. So yes, um, make sure you enter and I hope to have that out and have someone pick by the middle of August so that can go out and that person can receive that by September. So yes, um, again, thank you all for rocking with me. Yes, um, I cannot thank y'all enough. Y'all y'all have just been so great and I cannot be any more grateful for you all. New videos every Monday and Friday. Make sure you are subscribed, continue to grow, continue to glow. And I will see you in my next video. Toodles. Thank you.